A $1.5 million baseball field going to waste. Parents and coaches say the New York City Parks Department dropped the ball and for two years now have failed to order the right size pitcher's mound. As a result, three high school baseball teams are on a perpetual road trip, not allowed to play on their home field. So seven on your side, Nina Pineda stepped up to the plate. How many games did you play in your home field? Yeah. For the past two seasons, the Queens Metropolitan Varsity Baseball team has played all their home games on the road on inferior fields that look like this. It's kind of a disgrace. It's it's just terrible. They're not allowed to play here. Victory Field is their state-of-the-art home AstroTurf field. The Parks Department built it for $1.5 million. It's disappointing because the kids don't have a um, field to call home. I have 14 kids on my team and only two kids have ever played a home game. Richmond Hills Varsity and JBT team also share Victory Field. All three teams were told by the city it's off limits because the portable pitching mound at the field is too small. The problem is the pitching mound is only 10 feet and regulations required to be 18. Every time I pick off the second, my foot would roll, my ankle would roll, so I'm scared of getting injured. So it's a safety issue. Last May, Coach Free texted the Parks Department administrator over and over, telling her the mound was too small and needed to be 18 feet. She promised to write back ASAP, but... And then still nothing has happened, so I don't know sort of what the disconnect is. One, two, three, four, five, six. On this day, they're playing their home game at a nearby neutral field. Yeah, and it's, this is not as in good shape. No. And in the very first inning, a player was hit by a bad hop grounder. He was carted off the field, nose broken. I think it's horrible. You know, we pay our taxes, and this isn't a big ass. We asked Parks and Mayor Adams' office about the delay of game. Within days, the mound was finally ordered, but the maker can't deliver for months. So we found a different supplier. You have a mound. Yeah, yeah. You're willing to send this mound to the Parks Department. You're willing to pay for the freight, and they didn't take you up on it? Not not yet. <laughs> the owner of Aeroform in Missouri has a mound created for the Queens teams. He spoke to the city at our request. They uh, said, okay, we can't make any promises, but we'll do everything we can. And that was the last thing we heard from him. The Parks Department said they would stick with their original vendor, which won't deliver until this summer. I don't understand why it can't just be here while we still have a month, month and a half left in our season. His players don't get it either. Some are seniors hoping for scholarships. Now they'll graduate, never having played with home field advantage. 